the ratio of milk and water in four vessels are 1 is to 2, 3 is to 2, 7 is to 3 and 11 is to 1, 1 is to 1. The ratio of capacity of all vessels are in the ratio 1 is to 2 is to 3 is to 4. All are poured into a fifth vessel. Then find the ratio of milk and water in fifth vessel. So we have milk and water in four vessels are in the ratio 1 is to 2, 3 is to 2, 7 is to 3 and 1 is to 1. Now 1 plus 2 is equal to 3, 3 plus 2 is equal to 5, 7 plus 3 is equal to 10, 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. Then the LCM here is 3, 5, 10, 2 that is 30. LCM is 30. So 3 into 10 is equal to 30. So multiply first with 10. 5 into 6 is equal to 30. So multiply second with 6. 10 into 3 is equal to 30. So multiply third with 3. 2 into 15 is equal to 30. So multiply fourth with 15. Now total parts are equal. Now you have capacity of all vessels are in the ratio 1 is to 2 is to 3 is to 4. That means multiply 1 here, 2 here, 3 here and 4 here. Then if you calculate you can cancel here. No, no. You can you cannot cancel here. This is 3. This is 4. So, all are odd and even numbers. So, just multiply this. That is 10 into 1. First ratio will become 10 into 1. 10. 10 into 2. 20. Second ratio will become 6 into 2. 12. 12 into 3. 36. Is to 12 into 2. 24. Third ratio will become 3 into 3, 9. 9 into 7, 63 is to 9 into 3, 27. Fourth ratio will become 15 into 4, 60. So, 60 is to 60. Now, if you add together, 7 plus 4, 11, 1 here, 2 plus 2 plus 2, 6, 6 plus 6, 12, 12 plus 1, 13. So, 131. Now, 6 plus 3, 9. 6 plus 6, 12, 12 plus 3, 15, 15 plus 1, 16. So, 169 is to 131. Option A is your answer.